right, this time we have a video called Anime Girls Who Are Older Than You Think. Every character that's gonna show up in this video is gonna be a lolly, 100% guaranteed. Please go check out Mr. Anime World's channel and let's see number one. Who is it? All right, we get it started with Mafuyu Hoshikawa, 20 years old. Honestly, I could see that. Honestly, it's kind of hard to see that, but it's not like like compared to some of the other baby lollies that are supposed 9,000 years old. Like, yeah, she definitely looks on the younger side, but it's not horrendous. It's 20 years old. Like, it's 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 reasonable relatively to the other lollies. It's reasonable. Next, Maho Hiyachi, 21. I think this is even more reasonable. She looks actually older than the one on the left. I think this flame, like, no, I think that makes sense. <laughs> Tatsumaki from One Punch Man. Well, you guys know that one cosplayer that's always like every year there's this drama because that one petite cosplayer, you know, cosplayed as Tatsumaki and people say, oh my God, you're pandering towards a lolicon, you fucking pedo. 28 years old, huh? All right. Next up. Toaru Majutsu Index. Kiyomi Komoe, 30 years old. What kind of 30 year old looks like this, bro? This ain't a th what 30 year old does this shit? No, this is a fucking baby. This is you're like not even 10. Get the fuck out of here. Next. Oh shit, this one. <laughs> so fun fact, Masamune Kun no Revenge. We actually checked out the first three episodes and we published on YouTube about last year. But a company called Moby goes out to manually claim and block those so we couldn't continue. But yeah, the mom. Like, this is the fucking mom, right? 42 years old. <laughs> Jesus. Next up. Oh, Mushoku Tensei! Yeah, it doesn't make sense. However, she's a demon, okay? Roxy Migurdia. You know, demon continent girl, right? Roxy. She's always been this form the entire time, too. At least in season one. Biscuit Kruga, Hunter Hunter, 57 years old. People say, nah, bro, you don't know what her true form looks like. All right, fine. It's just every time we see this girl, I see this design. Honestly, isn't this Betty? Yo, this is a drill lolly. Yo, pink ribbon? Red to blonde drill lolly. That's a Betty clone. Or is Betty a clone of her? I don't know. Next. Fairy tale, Mavis, Vermilion. There's a ReZero spoiler. I don't care about ages of characters. I, that genuinely, I don't give a fuck if Betty's 400, 500, 600 years old. None of that shit matters. I don't care. Mavis Vermilion is 118 years old. Uh, she probably some sort of angel. I mean, look at her fucking, this earring stuff. I don't know on the sides. Next, no game, no life. Shui Dor, oh bro, this movie was so sad. Oh, this movie was so fuck, and it's and you know who you know why the main reason the main antagonist for the sadness is the girl that you guys fucking simp for straight up like this movie was terrorized by that fucking wing girl that you guys fucking simp for this this movie's great though yeah Gibral dude villain dude absolute villain but Shui this this movie, if you haven't seen this movie, go check it out. It's it's such a good movie. Yeah, Ted, Ted also fucking leeched. Overlord, uh, Evil Eye, 250 years old. Well, it's an isekai show and there's probably different races and different fucking demi-humans and different things. So like, I can see that, right? 250. <laughs> Miss Kobayashi's tracking me. <laughs> Kana Kamui. 300 years old. 300? <laughs> sure. Honestly, you look 300 days old, kid. Next up. The Dawn of the Witch. Rue Christase. Uh, 300 years old. I mean, at this point, what is the fucking difference, right? These both are fucking 300 years old. <laughs> Next. Oh, Yue! Hey, what's going on, Ari Furita? She's a vampire. 323 years old. Next, Hell Girl, I Enma. She looks fucking terrifying. She's wearing a Seifuku. Looks like a Japanese middle school, high school setting. 400 years old though, okay. Oh, here's Betty. I don't really care how old she is. This is not really a spoiler to me. 
ReZero, Beatrice, for only 400? Low key, I expected her to be in the thousands. Like genuinely. I thought that she was supposed to be some super, super ancient being, but 400, Beiko late made it on the list. Next up, Monogatari. Shinobu Ocean. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. This is the vampire one, right? Don't she got like a mill form as well? 500 years old. Shinobu Oshino. Got it. Next. Oh, shit. Smartphone Isekai. Lean. Her name is Lean. 600 years old. Um, Looks like a maid. Honestly, is this AI art? I can't tell. She's got like butterfly wings. I don't know what kind of being she is, but she's 600. Next up. <laughs> the helpful fox Senko-san. Senko, 800 years old. 800? In fox girl years? How does that work? Shouldn't it be the other way around? Where like, the younger you are, the older they are because of animal ages or some shit? I don't know, but uh, 800 year old fox girl here. Next. Hey, we got a demigod on the list. Rory Mercury. That's right. We got Lolly Mercury on the list. 960 plus years old. That's right. She basically attained uh, demi-human, demigod form when she was like looking like this physically and then it like stunted her physical growth, right? And that's the explanation why she looks like this. Listen, I'm not justifying, you know, whether or not it's, it's woodable or not. I'm just explaining you the fucking logic of why these characters look like this in the anime. Next up, we have Umineko Frederica Burncastle. Well, 1,000 years old. She looks like she wants to kill me. She looks scary. Umineko is the uh, visual novel, When They Cry. No, no, there's Higurashi, When They Cry, and Umineko... Is it also When They Cry? It's something cry. It's like a murder mystery kind of deal, right? I still... I, one of these days, bro. If we can bring the gaming content back, visual novel style, like, this could be pretty fun. Next up. Owari no Seraf. Kurul Tepes, bro. This girl, I feel like we've seen a variant of her in every anime. Fucking twin tail, reddish, pinkish, you know, girl tsundere. Right? It's this, this template exists in, like, fucking every anime. 1,000 years old. Next. Damachi! We got a god! We got a goddess on the list, Hestia, 1,000 years old. That's right, we got the homeless, broke-ass goddess, Hestia. <laughs> and she continues to get, get cucked by all the other humans. And other goddesses too, to be honest. Next up, oh boy. We got the G-string lolly herself, the Dragonoid, Medium Nava, Tensera, 2,000 year old. Which is still a baby compared to Diablo, because he already had to fucking live 2,000 years without fucking, you know, losing once, right? Or was it 2,000 opponents? I can't remember. Seven Deadly Sins in Merlin. Wait. Isn't Merlin supposed to be a MILF? Wait a minute. I thought Merlin was supposed to be a MILF. I swear to God, we've seen a different picture of her before. But Merlin, maybe there's like a kid version. 3,000 years old. Um, sussy. Sussy. Next up. Mondaiji. Shiroyasha. Yo, Mondaiji keeps being brought up. What is up with Mondaiji and the power scaling? It, 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 this is not the first time we've seen Mondaiji on the list. 5,000 year old. Um, yeah. 5,000 years old. We're gonna leave that alone. Next one. Fate. Okay, okay. When I see Shiroyasha Mondaiji, I can see some sort of fangs, and I can see like an eye and the horns that would denote like, you know, this is not a human. When I look at this fake girl, nothing tells me that she is not... <laughs> what the fuck is this a 6,000 year old girl? How? How? <laughs> Next up. A oh, Mushoku Tensei! Kishirika... Kishirisu, 7,000 year old. Yes, we got the demon emperor? This is demon emperor, right? Demon god is Laplace. Demon king is Barigari. There's multiple kings. Demon emperor is uh, Kirishika, right? Yeah. I forget the exact reasoning as to why she is in this form, but you can see on different statues when we went into like different labyrinths and shit. 
weren't there like bigger versions of her? So clearly she's in this stunted version right now for plot related reasons. Next. Darling in the Franks. Princess of Klaxorus. 60 million years old. Honestly, looking at a omnipotent end boss being like this, I can... Yeah, it, I, it, it, 60 million is a stupid number, but like, that's still more, like, reasonable compared to fucking Erica Ainsworth here, you know? Like, like, I could totally reason that this fictional, you know, villain, you know, empress looking girl at the end with this crown, like, is some sort of, like, omnipotent being a 60 mil, but like, 6,000 for Erica Ainsworth and fate is just what the fuck. Next, Kamikatsu! 10 billion. What the fuck is 10 billion years old, dude? I'm gonna assume she's some sort of goddess as well. Yeah, hold up. This is AI art. Yeah, whoa, 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 go back. What was here? Fuck, the, the fucking final thing shows up too early. Medica box. Isn't this, uh, what's it called? Future diary space, right? Isn't this Future Diaries face? We have Najimi Ajimu. Three trillion years old. Honestly, once you cross like millions, like it's 10 billion, three trillion, that's all the same shit to me. To be honest, like at, at a certain point, the numbers just fuck are fucking meaningless and I think that's pretty much it. Most of the list here honestly wasn't that bad. Like, cause I've already seen the enemy and I kind of understand what they would look like that. But I think the worst girl in terms of like an age that does not match their fucking face it's probably got to be Erica Ainsworth. Because, like, everyone else has some sort of demi-human qualities. But, like, this girl... <laughs> this fucking girl, dude. Anyways, here's the Enemy World video, guys. Please, go give him a like. Sub to the channel if you haven't. And I'll see you on the next one.